Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I've got three diamond paintings to show you. Um, the ones that I've had a while, so they're not in the original packaging and they're in clear covers. So I thought I'll show you these. Um, so let's get on and have a look. They're all poured glue, which is excellent. I like poured glue. But the first one I'm going to show you is this one. And I don't know if you can see it's a very very different painting and it's all about 2021 so i got this one from amazon all three of them came from amazon um and it was normally nine pound uh, 49 and i had a two pound coupon that uh, was with it so i got it for seven pound 59 okay and it was from the per neon no one Pernoen store, P-O-E-N-O-E-N. -E -E um, I'll put the details down below of where it came from. It is still available. I did have a look last night. Um, I ordered this one on the 26th of June and it did come the following day because I got it on Amazon Prime, which is wonderful. I love Amazon Prime. Get the television with it as well. So let's get this open and have a look. I'll just put those two out of the way because this is a little bit bigger painting. See if we can get it all on the desk. It's a 40 by 50. As I say, it is poured glue. But as you can see, it is of a 2021. Now, I did my coronavirus canvas. Just get all my bits and pieces out uh, for 2020. And then when I saw this one, which is for 2021, I thought, yep, yeah, I'm going to have that one. Um, I was a little bit dubious because it has got a lot of writing. So I'm not sure how the writing is going to come out. Let's see if we can just flatten this out a little bit. Let's just loosen. Uh, and now as well, when I get a poured glue, I always just check the edges uh, to make sure it is poured glue. If that was coming up there, um, and had an edge then it would be double-sided tape but I just don't trust uh, companies anymore after finding that I'd got three customs that all had clear covers on and finding that they were all double-sided tape which isn't good okay let's just see if we can flatten this out a bit and then we'll have a look I think this is fab I love the writing I'm hoping just put that out of the way somewhere but the writing will come out if it doesn't i can maybe tweak it it does look very clear on this though i must admit I just, if you just flatten the plastic covering out there it's underneath there no it's just a bump there let's just it does sometimes just uh, straighten the canvas out a little bit as well i've got a little bit curled at the edges there very very sticky this canvas and there is an awful lot of white to do but I think what I will probably do on this one is do all the colours first and then do the white in between or I may section it off I'm not sure but it being a 40 by 50 I may section it off because it won't quite fit there you are that's looking a lot flatter but yeah, I just thought I might as well mark the occasion. It, I doubt it'll go on my wall. It will just go in my portfolio. But I do like to mark the occasion, as it were, or good or bad. Okay, so what have we got? We've got wash your hands, binge watching. <laughs> what day is it? Yeah. Uh, curbside pickup. Oh, yeah, that's... Uh, for your um oh gosh takeaways and things glad my brain went then oh dear liz let me move my little scotty out the way we don't like to have our scotty things uh we have travel ban we've got home that looks like home i'm not sure what that says oh home workout it's that way up there six feet apart clean and organize yeah i've done a lot of that um wash those hands zoom yeah i've done a few zoom meetings facetime down this side 
what's your temperature with the temperature gauge um stay home curbside Ooh, don't know what that one says that's going to be uh, a difficult one to look up i don't know if you can see that something the curve something about i think that's curbside well it says herbside actually herbside pickup <laughs> um fl oh, flatten i think that says the curve that's to stop the thing spreading let the good times roll yeah flatten the curve protect game night survive the toilet paper shortage yeah <laughs> Um, what does that one say? Cancel plans, FaceTime, stay home, paper, toilet paper there. So, yes, yeah, so it's just a little bit of fun. Um, <laughs> toilet paper on it, that's fab. And uh, growing your own. So, yeah, it's uh, ah, quite like this. It's a very clear drill field. I don't know if you can see. There's no um, guide circles on it at all. Just try and not get any glare. You can see on the dark ones as well. So some of the writing's going to be a little bit iffy, so I might have to have a play about with that. But it's a big canvas, so we'll see how we go. But yeah, I just think that's how uh, oh, binge watching's fab as well. Yeah. And, uh, just to mark 2021, I like this one. Okay, so let's measure it then. I would think it'll be slightly, the drill area will be slightly shorter than 40 by 50, but we'll have a look. So it is, ooh, uh, oh, 44 that way, which is 17, just 17 and a quarter inches that way. By, let me have a look, uh, 35 centimetres, which is 30. Just under 14 inches that way, so it's 30 by 40 canvas, but the drill area is that little bit smaller, which you do tend to find um, on poured glue canvases. The toolkit, um, oh, that one's got a little bit bent. Looks like we've got uh, two pink pens with the thick style three places there, um, big pink piece of your know, translucent wax. Uh, quite a few of your little grip seal bags there and a green tray that's just got a little bit dented at the end there so enough there to get you started um, if you've not got any other supplies so that's good got a little leaflet oh, telling us how to diamond paint so that's good uh, oh it says there look press the finished painting to make the diamonds more fixed yep yeah, not quite sure what the pressing it with it looks like a box Okay, and yep, steps in English, steps in German, steps in French, steps in Italian, and steps in Spanish. So, you've got all your different languages there. Let's have a look at the drills. Um, it is, let me look, 24 colours. And we do have DMC codes there, which is good. And they all look nice, clear symbols, which is even better. Uh, we've got a B there with no eight. So they're all uh, capital letters. Uh, T and Y are a similar colour. But T and Y, sometimes if you're not looking, well, if I'm not looking straight. But other than that, I can't see any other colours that we're likely to get muddled up with there. So that's good. So yeah, let's have a look at the colours of these drills, see what quality we've got. Let's use the crinkle in. Oh dear, crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. Okay, get rid of that bag. I don't like those bags. Okay, so we have a lot of drills. Okay, so the main colour is 3865. And we have... One, three four five six seven packets of three eight six five so that's all your background but that looks pretty decent there's a little bit oh no that's not trash that's that an escapee look that's got squashed and another one there they've obviously not wanted to be in the bag and they've tried to get away 
Got the reasonably good drills, nice and shiny. Got a red there, is that? Oh, that's 3081. Got the green, that's uh, going to be for some of the lettering, I think. And a blue. And is that a darkish blue? Yeah, that's a real dark blue there. Okay, so that's those. And in the next lot, these are all the colours to make it all up, all the different pictures. So we've got lots of lovely pinks there, four pinks. And your fawny colour there, and a green, and a brown. Oh, that's a different colour. I've not had that one. That's like a mustardy colour. That one is 833. Ooh, it's like a, a tinned pea colour. <laughs> Uh, and then a navyish blue, pale blue, orange, two lots of red, yep, there's 666. And a hot pink, hot pink, yay! The blue, some more greens, a grey, another red, another green, and a burgundy. But they do all look, I can't see any trash in there, any extra little bits, so there's escapee in that one little one's tried to get away there and got squished but I can't see that they've got sometimes you get like the little skirt around the edges like a muffin top but I can't see any of that so, so that's our first picture to mark 2021 I do like that one As I, say, and I think for a poured glue um, 40 by 50 to be £7.59 was a really good deal so yeah, I'll be having a go at that one. Hopefully I'll try and get it done this year so it is actually done in 2021. But don't hold your breath. <laughs> okay. And then the next one. I think you can see what this one is. This one I've been using my Vipon code again. V-I-P-O-N. Um, it's an app. I'm not affiliated with them. I don't get any commission or anything. But I just think it's great when you can get things that a little bit cheaper and save a bit of money. So this one was half price. It's $8.99 on the Amazon website. Sold by Joy July or Joy Julie. Um, I will again put the item down below. And it's I got it for £4.49. And again, it's a poured glue canvas. Um, and on Amazon Prime. So I ordered this the 26th of May. And it came the next day, so that was really good. Okay. Let's get this one. It's been sort of folded, this one, rather than rolled. But with it being poured glue, we should be okay. Oh, there's all the drills there, lots of drills. And I think we just flatten this one out. But I just think that's a stunning picture. It's like... um. Uh, it's snow leopard. I think snow leopards are a bit fluffier, but it is with the spots. I don't think it is a leopard. And it's the 30 by 40 picture. So, a nice little project to do. Just give this a bit of a flattening out. Just lift the plastic. Again, just double check. Yeah, it's definitely poured glue. Something I'm always going to do now. I'm once bitten, as they say. Okay. So, yeah, I've got some really dark areas down here, and it's yeah, a very sticky canvas, and it's 22 colours, and again, it's got all nice capital letters there, which I can't see, we've got a D there, we've got a O, D and O are similar looking colours, um, so I'll have to be careful with that. But are they anywhere near together? Looks like the D's are all around here and the O's are all around there. So they're not together. So that should be okay. But yeah, that's uh, all I can see there that I'm likely to get confused with. The P's different colour to the R. Sometimes I get those muddled up. Um, as I say, my eyesight isn't brilliant. I know I bang on about it, but I just think, well, if I can do it, anybody can. Um, and, you know, there's a lot of things that I wouldn't attempt to do now. But diamond painting is one thing that I can do uh, with a poorer eyesight. But that is super. Let's have a measure again and see 
I would think again that it's the whole canvas that's affected by 40. So this is yeah 35 that way. So I presume it's going to be 20. Oh, got stuck. <laughs> and yeah, it's 25 that way. Um, yeah, so you do lose because of the edging, but that's fine as long as you know that's okay. But look at those blue eyes. It's, it looks really, really fierce as well. I don't know if I'd put this one on the wall because I think Millie would go mad. Uh, but yeah, a pretty clear drill field. Uh, the darker colours have got white on them, so it's not too bad. Sorry, you're getting a bit of glare there, aren't you? Let's try and... That's a bit better. But yeah, I think uh, this one's going to be okay to do. Um, oops, it's a very basic toolkit with just your three items, but it is a piece of red wax, not the translucent. Just a basic pen with no multiplacer and your green boat. And let's have a look at the drills. We have got your DMC codes. There's no DMC codes on the drills, but they are on the canvas, so that's fine for putting up. And we've got a brownie colour there. Let's look this way then. Oops. Oh, that's like a burgundy colour, actually. And then your darker colours, your leopard, your greys, and oh, that sort of greeny colour again. And we've got like a, a paley, stony colour. We've got a lot of pink here. Mm, so where does the pink go? Let me have a look. What number is that? That's number eight is I. Oh right, so the leopard is actually going to be a lot of pink on it. We're going to have a pink leopard. Now this will be interesting to see then, if that actually looks white when you put it on, because that is a very, quite a bold pink really. I mean it's a baby pink, but mmm. So that'll be interesting to see what colour our leopard comes out. A pink leopard. Okay, it is Pride Month. Maybe he'll go Mount Rainbow Colours. <laughs> okay, we've got a navyish blue there. I think we've got a bit crumpled. And a blue. And like a biscuit colour. And a chocolate colour. Can you tell it's uh, nearly dinner time? And like a rusty colour. And that looks like caramel chocolate that we used to get. And a brown. Looks like oatmeal colour. Green. And 18. It's 337 one, so that's a darkish brown colour. Okay, that's going to look really strange, that leopard in pink. I was thinking, where's the white? But anyway, and then we've got brown. We've got like the bluey grey colour and hot pink, hot pink, yay, hot pink. That's going to be around his tongue here. Okay, mm -hmm. so this one's going to be one to watch out for because I'm not sure about that pink leopard. I think the colouring may have gone off, but then again, once you've done these up and they've got the other colours around, it's amazing what pictures can look like. So I shall reserve judgment and we we'll wait and see. Okay, so that's that one. And then finally, this one is a partial and this has to be the cheapest diamond painting I have ever bought. And again, you know, it's one of those late night shopping do's. I just couldn't resist it. Um, it was normally... £4.89 and it's sold by, oh gosh, BACSW um, on Amazon and I got this for £1.95 with coupons and using the Vipon app. So yeah, <laughs> there's not much to uh, diamond paint on it. As I say, it is a partial. Uh, it's not a special drill. I don't think it's a special drill anyway. We'll have a look. Um, but yeah, just thought for £1.95. I may even give this one to my little, uh, she's now seven year old granddaughter because she's mad on stickers. She's done a, a notebook with a mermaid on and she's done a couple of cards. So it may be one for her to do to get her started on an actual canvas. Okay, I have done this picture before, I did it in a full drill 30 by 30. And it is the little bee on the honeycomb with the flowers. So it uh, looks like it's a 30 by 40 canvas. I will measure it 
but all we're actually going to drill on this is the B. <laughs> so, for, as I say, for £1.95, I think that's amazing. I love that, look, a little bee. But it's a lovely picture and I do love bees. I really do love bees. If you've seen my other videos, um, I've got a bee wreath to do and I can't wait to get started on that one. So, um, we've got the basic toolkit, but with quite a few zip seal bags in this, little baggies. Uh, no multiplacer and a very tiny bit of wax, but I mean, you don't really need much, do you? <laughs> and again, it's the red wax. <clears throat> it was me. And very, very few drills. <laughs> I'll say the cheapest diamond painting, and I think it's the one that's got the least amount of actual drills on that I've done. Okay. So, have a look. Oh no, there's no DMC codes. It's eight colours. Yeah, it does say it's a 30 by 40. And they're all numbered one to eight there as well. And they are all one is one, two is two, three is three, which is brilliant because if I get numbers where like six is seven and eight is number three, my brain can't cope and I get really confused with those. So, when a number is actually the number, that's brilliant. Okay, so oop, keep that a bit flattened. It just needs to go under something heavy just to keep it flattened down. Okay, so we have a nice blue colour. They look good quality drills as well, nice and sparkly. And like a mustardy colour, like a honey colour, nice bright yellow, and then we've got brown, darker brown, like a greeny brown and a grey. So there's no black on this. So the bee's not going to be black. It looks like it's going to be dark brown. And his wings are going to be like grey colour and blue. Mm, okay. So yeah, but that's really pretty. And it is a lovely picture. As I say, it, I have done this in a 30 by 30. Um, it was actually my first full drill canvas that I did um, in the square. Uh, sorry, in a, a round and when I remember looking at it thinking gosh this is going to take me forever and now I look at it and think gosh that was just sort of like a couple of days project really but it seemed to take forever but as you get used to doing things you get faster your technique gets a little bit better and uh, yeah I, I can do those a bit quicker now but at the time so I will always keep that picture um, purely because it was the first full drill canvas that I did but yeah this is just <laughs> drill a little bit. I think I will definitely give this one to my granddaughter because then she can say she's done a canvas. So yeah, that's really pretty. So we've had a bee that we've unboxed. We've had the fierce leopard that may or may not be pink. And then we've had our 2021, which I love. Can't wait to do this one. And I'll say that about all of them. But yeah, I am definitely going to make an effort and do this one in 2021 with it saying 2021. So watch this space. Well, that's it for now from me. Um, if you want to see whether I get this done in 2021, if you subscribe by pressing this button down here, um, it will notify you when my next video has come up. And if you've enjoyed uh, this little chat with me, then press the like button. It just gives me a bit of a help with that YouTube. And with that said, thanks for watching. Um, it's great to see you all popping by and I'll see you all again soon. Bye for now.